Confusion as 68 X-Men were killed in Kebi. McBan calls for investigation. The Mieti and Lakato Breeders Association of Nigeria has urged the Kebi state government and security agencies to investigate the alleged extrajudicial killing of 68 X-Men in four local government areas of the state. Alhaji Othman Ngazama, National Secretary of the Association, made the call in a statement on Thursday in Abuja. Ngazama alleged that the victims were killed by local vigilantes, known as the Kakari Yan Sakai in Zuru Sakaba, Fakai and Danko Wansago local government area of between April 29th and August 11th. This dastardly act, which started on April 29th, continued unabated, and no one is being arrested or being held accountable for these killings, he said. He listed locations where the killings took place as Technical College, Zuru, Danku, Maga River, Jolly, Kadoga, Marafa, Kansha, Unashi, and Ayu. Ngazama said McBan was worried by the silence and inaction of the traditional institution, local and state government, to deal with the lawlessness. The McBan National Secretary said the association had directed its Kebbi State chapter to ensure that all families affected by the killings exercise restraint and allow the law to take its course. As a responsible and law-abiding association, we will not allow the situation to further deteriorate because we always believe two wrongs do not make a right," he added. Efforts to get the reaction of the Kebi State Government and the Kebi State Police Command were unsuccessful. Thank you for listening to this news. Hmm. My viewers, I laugh. I laugh because these people, whenever it is their turn to to um, to to be deleted out of a community, or whenever it is their turn to be to be wiped out, that is when you will see different reaction from different places that is when you will see the president you know raising alarm and then um, shouting unnecessarily saying don't kill them don't kill them they are harmless forgetting that they started the killings at first they are forgotten well i won't have any single sympathy for them no single sympathy should be given to them because they started it. You understand? These people, they will invade your community. They will come in unexpectedly. They will come in, you know, destroy your crops, destroy the people, kill, rape. You know, in fact, they commit all sorts of atrocities and they will, and they will go scot-free. The government will not say anything. Now they are expecting the federal government to, to intervene or to say something. They are saying that up to now, the federal government have not done anything. They have not started. You see, I said it that the setup of this um, security and, and local vigilantes will help to get rid of these people one after the other. It will help to get rid of them and their atrocities one after the other these people they think they can they can they can go away with all of their excesses good what i would say is a good job from those uh, vigilantes that have gotten rid of them it well it just 
so 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 bad so bad that um, they were they were eliminated so bad for them but then they asked for it they asked for it because they started it have they forgotten are they forgotten how they keep terrorizing the community killing people unjustly have they forgotten have they forgotten how they murder and rape people hmm. these people will not seem to amaze me they will not have they forgotten in fact it's just a beginning this is just the beginning they have not seen anything at all they have just seen a little a little is what they have just seen well the mcban they're supposed to raise alarm because it's an association that is helping to protect the Northerners from being um being killed or being being intimidated and so on you know so let them raise alarm let them find out find a solution to that and let them see how to help um get out the killers of the uh of the fulani uh people you know but then they should not forget that these people actually started it and now they are getting it one after the other you understand so my viewers well i don't know your own opinion concerning all that has just been said but to me um my sympathy to them is at zero percent because these same people they don't have any atom of sympathy when committing their own atrocity they don't sympathize with anybody they do whatever they want to do and they go scot-free even the federal government will not say anything concerning it they won't even voice out they won't even you know intervene see what they did to 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 to, to the people to people in emo states see how they brutalize people kill people un, un, unjustly see what they did to people you will marvel you will marvel you will be short of words you see now you see the importance of this um of this uh local vigilante you can see their importance and that is why i i suggested that for um for the governor of um of 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 benin you no know, saying that it will really help if for the sake of this um coming gubernatorial election in Edo state because i know that the nigerian security force cannot be able to do everything they won't be able to do everything so it should be able to set up a local vigilant to help secure the uh, to, to help protect the local communities you know the local communities to prevent uh, this uh, this snatching of ballot boxes and all of that you know not to not to not to occur and also any violence that we that will that will come up so my viewers what's your own take on this news please um don't hesitate to leave those comments of yours behind click on the subscription button as well as bell button to get updated whenever we upload any new videos thank you